With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, I am your teacher for this question and the question is a mixture of NaHC2O4 and KHC2O4.HC2O4 require equal volumes of 0.2 normal KMnO4 and 0.12 normal NH separately. So what is the molar ratio of NaHC2O4 and KHC2O4.H2CO4 in the mixture? So in the question, it is given that a mixture of NHC2O4 and KHC2O4.HC2O4 which require equal volumes of KMnO4 and 0.12 normal NH. So we have to find the molar ratio of the given mixture. So first of all the KMnO4 will get uh, will detitrate the NHC2O4 and KHC2O4.HC2O4 solutions and NH solution will neutralize these uh, these solutions. So first we will assume let the moles of NaHC2O4 and KHC2O4 dot H2C2O4 solutions be X and Y respectively. So we have to find out the ratio of X by Y. This is asked in the question. So now, first when KMnO4 reacts with NaHC2O4 and KHC2O4.H2C2O4, it will titrate the, that is these are the oxalic acid solutions. So KMnO4 will titrate this. So when with KMnO4, first we will see its reactions as MnO4 negative from KMnO4 and C2O4 to negative that is oxalate ion it will get oxidized to CO2 and MnO4 negative will get reduced to Mn2 positive for NHC2O4. Now C2O4 to negative when it is converted to CO2 we will first balance this reaction as here 4 oxygen atoms and here 2 are present so we will write 2 water here. Now there are 4 hydrogens so we will write 4H positive here. So now the atoms in the equation are balanced but the charge is not balanced as 4 positive and 2 negative it will be 2 positive. So we will first write balance the equation by adding 2 electrons. Now in this reaction 2 electron involvement is there so its NF that is its valency factor will be 2 as valency factor is the number of electrons involved in the redox reaction so its nf will be 2 now when mno4 negative it reacts with khc2o4 or it titrates khc2o4.hc2o4 solution it will have 2 c2o4 2 negative that is one from this and one from this so it will form two moles of co2 and one mole of mn2 positive now when we will see that 2C2O4 2 negative will form 2CO2 as we have seen for 1C2O4 2 negative when it oxidized to CO2 its NF will be 2 so when 2C2O4 2 negative get oxidized to 2CO2 its NF will be 4 so now when MnO4 negative, KMnO4 solution completely titrates both these solutions of NaHC2O4 and KHC2O4.H2CO4 solutions, their equivalents will be equal. So we will write number of equivalents of KMnO4 is equal to number of equivalents of NaHC2O4 plus number of equivalents of KHC2O4 dot H2C2O4 solution. Now what are number of equivalents? Number of equivalents is equal to normality into volume. 
or we can say normality is equal to the number of equivalents per unit volume. So we can put number of equivalents is equal to normality into volume for KMnO4 and for NHC2O4 and KHC2O4 solutions number of equivalents is also equal to the number of moles into its valency factor. So we will put the corresponding values here as the normality of KMnO4 solution is given as 0.2 normal and its volume we will suppose it as B and the number of moles for this we have supposed as X and for KHC2O4 we have supposed as Y. So we will fill their respective values as number of equivalents of KMnO4 will be equal to its normality that is given 0.2 normal into its volume we will suppose as V. Number of equivalents of NHC2O4 will be equal to its number of moles into its n factor. Number of moles we have supposed it as x and n factor we have calculated above here is 2. So it will be 2x plus number of equivalents of this and their number of equivalents will be equal to its number of moles that is we have supposed y and its n factor that is 4. So it will be 4y. Now it will we will simplify this as 0.1v will be equals to x plus 2y. So this is our first equation when the titration with KMnO4 occurs. Now with NOH simply acid base reaction or neutralization reaction occurs. Neutralization occurs. When NaOH reacts with NaHC2O4 as it has one hydrogen atom or one H positive it will give one H positive so it will neutralize to form one mole of water so its NF will be one and when NaOH get to neutralize KHC2O4 dot H2C2O4 it has it will give 3 H positive so it will form 3 moles of water correspondingly 3 NOH will be required so its NF will be 3 so now similarly we can get their gram equivalents be equal that is number of equivalents of NOH will be number of equivalents of NHC2O4 plus number of equivalents of this so we will write as number of equivalents of NOH is equal to number of equivalents of NHC2O4 from the neutralization and the number of equivalents of KHC2O4 dot H2C2O4. So the normality of the NH solution is given as in the question it is given as 0.12 normal and they, it is given that equal volume so we will suppose its volume will also be equals to V. Now we will put it as 0.12 V equals to here the number of equivalents will be equal to number of moles into n factor its number of moles we have supposed as x and its n f factor is 1 so it will x and number of equivalents for this will be number of moles into its n f factor that is 3 so it will be 3 y so we will let this equation as 2. Now we have two equations and two variables so we can solve it as dividing 2 by 1 so it will give us 0.12 upon 0.1 it will give us x plus 3y upon x plus 2y. Now on solving this further it will be equals to 12 by 10 so it will be equals to x plus 3y upon x plus 2y which can be simplified further as 12 into x plus 2y is equals to 10 into x plus 3y. It will give us 12x plus 24y and 10x plus 30y. So we will like terms on one side that is 30y minus 24y so it will give us 2x is equals to 6y and we have to calculate the ratio of xy x by y so it will be 6 by 2 that is 3 by 1 
so the molar ratio of NH C2O4 and KH C2O4 dot H2 C2O4 solution and their molar ratio is 3 is to 1. So I hope you understood the solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.